sped really in the scooter. You can get the blow dryer too. <laughs> Every, I've seen someone use those. I've seen someone use. Yeah, these, Chris used those. Those. And I've seen someone use those. Nah, I haven't seen nobody use the color pros yet. I don't think yet. But those guards come in regular. Wall yeah, come in regular walls. That's what I'm thinking. Hey, you cut my hair, bro. It needs to be fresh. <laughs> oh, it's a clipper and then it has a built-in. Oh, you trimmer. put the trimmer on top of it? No. Yeah. Look, you flip it. Oh. You flip this piece. And it's a trimmer. Oh, I don't know if I like that. But get the clip and trimmer. For for YouTube's sake, get the clip. Right, get so the clip and trimmer. I'm going with these. Two in one. The same clipper. Someone Ain't nobody got the same clip. I haven't seen no one use this. This is like some next level 2K17 stuff. You ain't never seen a clipper and a trimmer in one. Going in my car. It's going in my car. Throw it in the cart, boy. Look at this dude. The goodies. The goodies. I'm, I'm gonna get the Ragers too, y'all. So Sierra make these? Hey, Sierra. <laughs> Sierra make these. <laughs> Alright. So I'm already like $34, $35 for these clips. The goodies, do you use these? Alright, I'm using them. Those are in, those are in Clark. All right, cool. We got the goodies. Got the goodies. Got the clippers. Got the, got the trimmers. Yeah. Gel? Got to get that gel. Where's the gel? Left. See you on Cheap gel. Cheap gel. Cheap gel. That'll work. How much is that? Got to go cheap, bro. Cheap as possible. Too much. Four dollars. Too much. Four dollars. Too much. We rolling. That two hundred forty-five dad hat, though, boy. Right there, Ellie looks. Huh? LA looks, dollar ninety four. Bam! Oh, yo, tell me I don't remember this. Yo, if you ain't use this, tell me I ain't use it. We gonna do the sport one. We'll do a sport, sport one. Yo, and it has a ten plus. Dollar ninety four. You know it's the. Or use the or hey, actually use the women's uh. The women's dick. Yeah, because you know they got that aloe on the strip and we making it better for the skin. And since you're shaving my head. Silky touch. Yeah, silky touch. You can touch it is. Wall and 47 right there. Yeah, that one. Look, dollar 47. Ace. It's not even a name brand. This is Ace. You know what? I would like to use a baby brush. A baby brush? That way it's not so harsh. Whatever I'm brushing. It's a soft grip brush and comb. He knows for baby, so it has to be soft. 45 11. Spent $34 on one trimmer. All right, so we bought an inverter for the truck, and that way we can have power. So I just unboxed it. We gotta plug this into the lighter. We right here in the Walmart parking lot. The inverter in the truck, so I have power. Got a barber chair in there. And we right here in the back of Walmart, y'all. Look at this. This is how you know it's legit. My boy Loco in there. In the back, look, this is Walmart, y'all. Just showing y'all, this is Walmart. You ready? You ready? All right, so here are the clippers right here, y'all. This is what I'm gonna be working with. Man, these are bulky. Alright, so this is a trimmer right here. Check it out. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> Look at the trimmer, y'all. What's good, YouTube? Your boy Matt Gifted Hands. Alright, so right here I'm just draping my client. I'm using a paper towel, y'all. A paper towel for the next strip. I'm gonna start sectioning off the hair right here and I, I bought some Walmart hair clips these really work y'all they really work everything that I use in my video with with uh, this challenge is all Walmart related let me just say that loud and clear everything I use is Walmart related y'all this is right behind Walmart in the back 
and this is crazy the, the clipper that i bought it converts into a trimmer like the clipper is the trimmer it like flips out it is crazy but they actually hit so i'm just attacking this blend just like any other fade i'm using the same guidelines i'm starting with the i started balding out then i went with the lever open and then I started closing it to the middle and then I closed it all the way to knock out that line. And let me just tell you, I've been cutting Chris Local's hair for a while now and his hair is so difficult. It's difficult with expensive clippers, also fast feeds. But you know what you want to know something funny? His blend came out flawless and if it's not the best then close to the best fade I've ever given him that's that's funny with Walmart clippers y'all the whole setup that I had was forty five dollars and eleven cents minus the inverter cuz I mean you didn't really need that I needed it cuz I wanted to do it outside and be crazy and being in a Walmart parking lot and I didn't want to plug my clippers into the into the wall at Walmart because then I don't know I think I would have got caught doing that but so I bought the inverter so I could have power but forty dollars and eleven cents now I would say save your money stack up and get you some nice pair of clippers and trimmers I mean if you have to, to be honest with you these clippers right here they're dope and I did zero gap them. And it's funny because I didn't even have any kind of tools to take off the screw to zero gap them. So I used the shears that came with the, the clippers in the box. You got to find the S. Y'all got to find the S. But I'm telling you, his hair is real thin, real spotty. And it's difficult to cut hair. To cut his hair with expensive clippers let alone walmart clippers and it's crazy how this blend came out 360 g's you gonna call me out <laughs> you got another thing coming boy now nah, but i think this was fun i had an amazing time filming this editing this video going to walmart it, it was i love this i love the challenge y'all Thank you 360Gs for, for uh, challenging me, but um, I think I killed it, bro. And I did a design. That's the crazy part. I did a design with some Walmart trimmer, clippers, converter things. <laughs> They're called the clip and trim. That's pretty catchy. And you got, guys, I'm using a baby brush. All the all the other brushes at Walmart, man, them things were rough. So I went to the baby aisle and got me a baby brush. And it was hot outside, y'all. It was hot. You could tell the sun is beaming. Right here, you could tell the sun went down a little bit, but then it comes right back out of the clouds. And I wanted to keep the fade a little low. That way I can give myself room to blend. Kind of like a draw fade, contouring the shape of his head. This side kind of gave me a little bit of a trouble, but I mean, I made it work. I spent a little more time detailing and getting those dark spots out and it, the whole haircut just came out amazing. Especially with the circumstances that I'm in, I'm outside. <laughs> I had to buy an inverter for power. The sun is beaming.
but I wanted to do something different. I wanted to do something wow, you know? I mean, if you want to top this, I think for me, for you to top this, you got to cut hair inside Walmart in the restroom or something. Guys, just to let y'all know, the thank you tour is official. First stop is going to be in Texas. We're not sure if we're going to hit Dallas or Houston first. Um, but the thank you tour is official. We're going to be going on tour with the Tomb Squad. It's going to be featuring Chris Bazio, 360GZ, Christian Perez, myself, Tyler Trotter, Clean Cuts, and Chris Loco, and Macho. Chris Loco and Macho are going to be on the mic. They're going to be the MCs. Yo, if y'all are ready for a show, they're going to keep it live in there. I'm telling y'all, they're beasts on the mics. But Chris Loco's marketing skills and Macho's personality and personality and energy, we're going to kill it. They're going to kill it. The lineup is sick. We got a lot of knowledge and education and a lot of hands-on that we want to provide to to y'all. So be on the lookout for the first stop. It's going to be in Texas, but we're not sure if it's going to be Dallas or Houston yet. I'll keep y'all posted with the dates as well. I also live streamed this video. That's why Chris Logo is holding the phone. He's holding my phone while I'm cutting hair. We had about 13 strong on the live feed. I appreciate y'all. If y'all if y'all were on the live stream, man, thank you. They said some kind words on there. They were saying I already won. I didn't even drop the video yet, and they already said I was winning. They said 360 Jeezy was done. So Chris Bazio did the Walmart Clipper Challenge. He did it inside of the shop with a barber chair, AC. Christian Perez was like, you know what? I'm gonna go ahead and do it in the garage. No AC, no spin chair. And then I was like, you know what? I'm gonna try to do something in the middle. I'm gonna do something crazy. I'm gonna go to Walmart, cut in the parking lot, put the barber chair in the back of the, the monster uh, headlines monster truck, and I'm gonna do this. Guys, I, I still do have the clippers. I don't know what I'm going to do with them. Give me some ideas. Get active in the comments below and give me some ideas of what do you think I should do with this clipper. As you can tell, I'm just doing a lot of detail work. I was having trouble on this side, but I made it work. Like I said before, this dude's hair is difficult to cut, but it was crazy how the blend came out. I was I was real happy how it came out. He was happy how it came out, so that's all that matters. I mean, what y'all think? I think the blend's coming out good.
had a lot of natural light in this video so that helped out a lot but man that sun was beaming I think that blend's coming nice. Coming out nice. Using a lot of corner of the blades. Yo, these things were hitting, y'all. I zero gapped them and I didn't have no tools, so I used my the shears that came with it to unscrew it. And I put them real nice and real nice and close. So I could take out that trimmer line. Y'all don't understand, this clipper was so bulky. Man, it was so bulky. Now, I'm still tripping about how this clipper in converts into a trimmer. That's crazy. You can tell, they, I mean, they're lining up nice. So if the being outside and cutting at Walmart and using an inverter for power wasn't enough, I had to do a design. That's just me. I love doing designs and I was like, let's just top it off. Let's the cherry on top. All right, look right here. I broke the big razor and and I started just to use a razor with just my hand, no handle, nothing, just a razor. I ended up breaking it. I stayed true to this Walmart challenge, y'all. I didn't use nothing that wasn't from Walmart. I used the LA Looks gel to razor this dude, man. Just saying, Basil used Tune 45. Perez used Tune 45. I used LA Looks. And to style the hair. I didn't use a blow dryer. I didn't use any anything that wasn't Walmart related in this video, y'all. Nothing. This is a finished product. What do y'all think? Ooh, that came out fresh. So as y'all know, 360GZ called me out on the Walmart Clipper Challenge. So I'm gonna leave his I'm gonna leave his YouTube channel link below in the description. Make sure y'all go show some love to him. But GZ. I think I killed you, bro. I'm sorry. I accepted your challenge and I murdered it. I murdered it. All right, just to let y'all know, I had to buy an inverter for the power to plug it into the truck to have power for my clippers. I did have a barber chair in the back of the truck of the Headlines Monster truck, but I was in the parking lot, y'all. The parking lot of Walmart and did the whole challenge. And I live streamed it on Instagram, so I apologize if you missed it, but I mean, you just saw the video, so. Anyways, make sure you subscribe to my channel. If you haven't subscribed yet, hit that subscribe button, smash that like button, get those thumbs up. Y'all, I'm trying to get to 10,000 subscribers.
Let's get to 10K and I'll do another giveaway. What do y'all think? Everything in my video is Walmart related from the brush, the comb, LA looks. Yo, LA looks, really? I went to a gel, like a dollar something, and use it to style the hair. I think I, I think I did a good job. But I have to call out two more barbers. The first barber I'm gonna call out is Tyler Trotter. Clean cuts. Yep, I'm calling you out, bro. I'm calling you out to the Walmart Clipper Challenge. Now, the second barber I'm gonna call out, she's a hidden gem in the barber industry and the YouTube industry. She just started her YouTube channel. Second barber I'm gonna call out, Akira Meek. I'm calling you out. Yep, they do. I'm calling you out on the Walmart Clipper Challenge. Both of y'all barbers, step up to the plate, and just like Jeezy said, eat this!